Jordan Rubin is one of America's most recognized and respected natural health experts. He is the New York Times best-selling author of The Maker's Diet and 24 additional titles, including his latest work, Planet Heal Thyself. At the age of 19, after living an active, completely healthy childhood, Jordan was suddenly diagnosed with Crohn's disease. He went from being a 185-pound athletic young man to 104 pounds and in a wheelchair. A year later, in the midst of a life or death struggle, Jordan met a man who encouraged him to follow a health plan taken directly out of the pages of the Bible, a plan proven through history and confirmed by science. Jordan committed himself to follow God's wisdom for health and life, and in just 40 days, his health was transformed. Today, Jordan's mission is to transform the health of this nation and world one life at a time. Dr. Josh Axe is a doctor of natural medicine, doctor of chiropractic, and clinical nutritionist with a passion to help people eat and live a healthy lifestyle. Dr. Axe operates one of the world's largest natural health websites, draxe.com. He has authored several celebrated and best-selling books, including Eat Dirt, The Real Food Diet Cookbook, and Essential Oils Ancient Medicine. His newest book, Keto Diet, a 30-day plan to lose weight, balance hormones, and reverse disease, will soon be released worldwide. Dr. Axe is an expert in digestive health, functional medicine, natural remedies, and dietary strategies. Dr. Axe has been featured on many television programs, including The Dr. Oz Show, CBS, and NBC. 15 years ago, I had had breast cancer. I remember one day my mom, who was actually my gym teacher at school, came home and actually told her family that she'd been diagnosed with breast cancer. And I just remember even going in the bathroom and seeing, you know, just chunks of hair in the sink, just looking like she aged 20 years in two weeks. I developed a cough. And um, so they went and did, they did an x-ray and they found a two centimeter mass on my lung. And they said that my cancer had returned. She calls me and says, you know what, I'm, I've just been diagnosed with these tumors on my lung. She's like, I don't know what to do. They weren't sure if it was um, metastasized breast cancer or if it was lung cancer. I told her I'd be home, flew home, and sat down with her and just said, you know, we need to take care of this all naturally. And so we just radically changed her diet. We started going through a detoxification process, had her start exercising. He got me set up with a chiropractor, started there three days a week, and I continued going to the, the oncologist, um, continued to go to the different doctors, the surgeons that they sent me to, because I'm listening to a 23-year-old. There was a major conflict in my head because I said to a friend, I'm looking at a 23-year-old, a young boy, and I'm listening to the med, you know, the oncologists, the surgeons, you know, and they're just so insistent. And this friend says to me, what is your heart telling you? I said, my heart's telling me to listen to Josh. I just, I just feel, you know, really led and really strong that way. And she said, well, that's the way that you need to go then. We went back to the oncologist after about three months, redid her CT scans. The mass doesn't show up on the x-ray. Went back nine months later. It had shrunk to one centimeter. It just kept shrinking and they, they couldn't figure out you know what was going on. And right now it's been about five years and she's in the best shape of her life. When I started this, despite what they were telling me, all of a sudden I felt all this energy. It's just like, just some kind of life within me. God put this amazing healing power in our bodies and really every three to four months we have entirely new red blood cells, entirely new organs. You know, every year we have an entirely new body and I just knew that if we put, if we started doing all the right things with her, just like I'd done with other people in the past, that she was gonna get well. Josh has tried to get me off my sugar, so instead of using uh, syrup, I've learned to use blueberries. I'm doing what I can do nutritionally. I didn't feel like I could continue to go to fast food, continue not to eat healthy, continue to stress. I feel like right now she's probably in better shape than 
99% of people out there. At 56, I feel better and healthier than I did in my 40s. I'm just so proud of him because I feel he's out there helping people. I really just see her happier and healthier than ever. Well, I'm a believer. <laughs> I'm in awe of God and how he's worked. And when I was pregnant, I named him Joshua because I wanted him to be a Joshua. I wanted him to be a servant of God, but a leader of people. And, um, and that's what I see. Meet Winona Axe in yes. person. Wow. Yes. What a what treat. A testimony. Yes. Her son, Dr. Axe, is right here next mm -hmm. to me. And Jordan Rubin is all the way down there, uh, the, the healthy, good looking guy. <laughs> he's got he's in between two handsome guys. That's right, he's got a diamond right <laughs> in the middle. Place. <laughs> but, but you folks that are watching, you're going to hear uh, opportunities for mm -hmm. you to take care of the temple of the Holy Spirit, which uh, is just so important. We only get one of this, okay? And take care of it. And we're going to give you some ideas today from the expert. You know, it's, it's some time ago, uh, we were talking about having Dr. Axe and, and Reuben Jordan. Jordan Rubin, excuse me. He's got, he's got two, two first names. Uh, but, but, uh, uh, but uh, and our daughter down in Sarasota, she's, I mean, are you kidding me? Uh, you, you know, are you really going to have Dr. Axe? And so Sharon broke it to her. She goes, yes, we are. So you're kind of like a rock star. Wow. Yeah. I'm honored. And, and, and Jordan Rubin has been with me what, at least 10 years ago. Yeah, and I think mm -hmm. you called me Reuben Jordan then. That's, that's exactly <laughs> right. I still haven't got it right. And, and, and I, I don't even have age now to blame it on, because you can prove I did it then. But, that is funny, yeah. I don't remember that. But we're, we're gonna be talking about bone broth breakthrough, and you're going to have an opportunity to have the product that you'll see on your screen. We're even going to be able to mix a drink, you know, the kind that you know, we can get away with right here <laughs> on Christian television. But you're going to have an opportunity to have your own book and products, and so you'll be seeing that on the screen. Doctor. Yeah? What, what's bone broth breakthrough? Now, now, I have to tell you, I actually did this. I tried it. Hmm. And I tried it in water. And you would have to have an acquired taste to do that. So I added some juice. It was great. Yeah. So, I mean, I, I, do you do you actually take it yourself? Yeah, absolutely. You know, for for years, I used to make bone broth and drive to my farmer's market and buy the bones, Seriously? put it in a slow cooker, and make it. You know, the big reason is it's something all of our ancestors consumed, and it's so healthy for us. I mean, bone broth is really the ultimate superfood. But you know, I realized, and talking to Jordan, that. It was just difficult to make. Like I wanted all of my patients consuming bone broth every day because it's so great for your gut health. It's so great for your skin, hair, and nails. It's so great for supporting your immune system, especially your joints, you know, mobility, flexibility. But a lot of people don't want to take the time to make it. And I shared this with Jordan, and Jordan came up with an idea to take bone broth, put it into powder form, so people could start getting this the ultimate superfood Way to go. every single day in their diet. And so, you know, this is something that I consume every day, my wife, all the people I've cared for over the years. So yeah, bone broth or bone broth protein is a product that people should be getting every single day because all of our ancestors got bone, bone broth in their diets and we really should too Explain every day. Explain that. What, I mean, what is bone broth? Yeah, so, so bone broth is the extracted um, liquid that you get from simmering bones, ligaments, and tendons, but it's really rich in certain nutrients, including collagen and specifically collagen type two. And a lot of our body is made up of collagen. In fact, most of our skin, hair, nails, bones, discs, gut lining, joints, our ligaments, our tendons, our connective tissue, all of that is made up of collagen. And if we're not getting collagen in our diet every single day, really? those areas of our bodies can suffer. Also, bone broth is high in glucosamine, chondroitin, and hyaluronic acid. All of those are really um, supportive of our joints and our skin and our digestive health. But really, if people have joint problems, this is the ultimate superfood to consume. Uh, Wynonna, did you know he was doing that to you when you were? <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. He, um, 
I had no knowledge of what it meant to be healthy except for eating salads. And yeah. it was yeah. step one, here we go. Mom came home, cleaned out our cupboards and said, this is what you eat for breakfast, lunch, supper, snacks. Um, these are the basic supplements. And then he started learning from different doctors around the country. And then he'd send me more supplements to take. Um, just kept adding to different things. Of course, I went to church, had him pray for healing. Right. Um, I read scripture. I fell asleep to healing scriptures every night because I believe that um, God's word is actually healing. Amen. And then I feel um, I did what I could do and trusted God to do the rest yeah. because I knew. Yeah, and I and, and I tell everybody she was my best patient I ever had because <laughs> my mom, you know, when I told her to do things like you know doing like now she does her bone broth smoothie mm -hmm. every single morning and you. started taking the supplements like turmeric and you know just eating healthy. But she's mm -hmm. she's a very compliant and great patient. Yeah, <laughs> Jordan Rubin world famous author. Mm -hmm. I, I mean, literally 10 years ago when I had him on, it was like there again, it was like, you're mm -hmm. going to have Jordan Rubin on? Oh, yeah. Seriously? I mean, there was a time when I don't think there was a program on secular TV that you were not on. I was hitting the circuit, Herman. <laughs> didn't, have, didn't have the white glasses, but other than that, I had it all. <laughs> no. So but, you guys met each other somehow, right? Because you're making such a great team now. Yeah, we did. And uh, when I was on those television yeah. programs promoting the Maker's Diet and other books and started a company called Garden of Life. Yes. Josh was coming up in chiropractic school and became aware of the Maker's Diet and mm -hmm. the Garden of Life products. Mm -hmm. And ultimately we were introduced by a mutual friend in ministry. We met, I believe in 2009, and Josh was interested in me helping him, advising him on his first book, The Real Food Diet, and we stayed in close connection, developed a friendship, and ultimately about a year and a half ago, decided that two are better than one and wanted to join forces. And so we are now partners in helping transform God's people and their health one life at a time. Wow, so, so, so I mean, we got two superstars in business together. That's, <laughs> that's kind of unusual because yeah. You know, usually, I, I mean, uh, you're a go-getter. You have to be that to made it through all the schools and training. Yeah. And, and this guy is an extrovert. He can sell, you know, uh, refrigerators in in Alaska. And, and I mean, so you, so you, so you you then marry somebody that I mean, in business that is uh, that you don't compete. Well, I, I think that a our message is complementary, and so. As Josh mentioned, he is a huge believer in bone broth as a superfood. I'm a huge believer in bone broth. We agree on almost every major, right? And so talking about a marriage, you gotta agree on yeah. the majors. Mm -hmm. And on the minors, some areas Josh is more focused on and passionate about, some uh, would fall into my camp. And I think together we have a powerful one-two punch. And right now, uh, Josh and his team have done such a great job of connecting with all generations of people. Yep. And it, it's just a, it's a different day as Sharon and I were talking off the air, media has changed. Yeah. And what was great about the Dr. Axe team is that they have been able to bring a relevant message of health and hope to an audience from young and older alike. And you both have, you got two testimonies here. I don't know about you, Josh, whether you're doing it, but I'm saying, of, of health absolutely. because of eating right, yeah, absolutely. you know, yes. uh, you've, your mm -hmm. life shows that. Two you know, miracles. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, well, you know, we talk to people all the time and they go, okay, you, you, you guys have always taken care of yourself and whatever, you know, does it really make any difference? Doctor? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, it, it absolutely does. And I'll say this too, I mean, we have two, again, amazing yeah. miracle stories yeah. here, but I, myself, I, I was overworking and um, even though I thought mm -hmm. I was eating pretty healthy, I was working too much and uh, Were you a good early, student? Early on in practice, I've always been a pretty good student. Um, Mom? Since, not in high school, but after <laughs> high school. Notice the interruption. Yeah, after high work. school. So right. let's, let's forget yeah. about high school. Forget about high school. <laughs> Same way with me. Then, but, you know, early on in practice, I started de developing digestive issues myself, and I radically changed my, started working a little bit less, building more peace in my life, and then started drinking bone broth, and I noticed an incredible improvement in my digestive health. And, you know, Hippocrates said... What did, okay. Yeah, go ahead. What does that feel like? You said, I noticed 
a different in my diet. What I mean, can you explain what that felt like? Yeah, you know, for a lot of people out there, they struggle with issues like loose stools or diarrhea. A lot of people struggle with issues that are also related to not having enough healthy bowel movements on a regular basis. Just, you know, any type of digestive issue. That's what killed Elvis. Yeah, well, yeah, a lot of people. I loved Elvis. So, so bone broth, actually, here, here's what's really unique about bone broth is our gut lining yeah. is made up of collagen. Bone broth is this greatest source of collagen in the world. So when somebody starts drinking collagen, they're giving their body the building blocks it needs wow. to support a healthy digestive system. Not, you know, and other things, of course, from you know joint health to the health of their, uh, you know, their skin and, 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 and supporting the immune system. Jordan. Yeah, yeah. Those pictures we saw of you, mm -hmm. I mean, you, you started out, I mean, you were like, like, a, like an athlete, visually, mm -hmm. and then you went down to almost death. Very close. And wished for it some days, sadly. Did you? Yeah. Oh, absolutely. So you were in pain also? All the time. And I slept for 45 minutes at a time at most. And so it was a 24-hour-a-day, two-year living hell. I, I describe it as being trapped in a prison that was my own body. And mind you, when I was diagnosed with Crohn's disease, this was 20 some years ago. Today, the incidence of those type of diseases have skyrocketed. And as Josh mentioned, what we'd call functional digestive challenges, occasional constipation, diarrhea, gas, bloating, occasional heartburn, that's a regular occurrence for most people. And so what Josh and I do, we try to find ancient superfoods and create recipes or products to meet people's needs in the modern world. That's what it's about because bone broth's amazing. It takes 24 hours to make. Mm -hmm. Juice is amazing. It takes time to buy, time to clean up. So what if we could give people not just the tools to consume something powerful, but the actual building blocks itself. And so we have inspired, I believe, tens of thousands of people to get bone broth in their diet just like Every one of our ancestors did. In the ancient world, no one would consume meat without making an extract of the bones. My grandmother in Poland, they had one chicken soup a week. She got the dreg. She's like, all I got was the broth. I didn't get any meat. I got broth and what they called schmaltz and gribbonus, which is the fat and some of the skin renderings. But I would say, Grandma, you got the best stuff. Everyone else ate the white meat. You got the best. And my grandmother would then uh, serve us chicken as uh, I was getting older. And where's grandma? She's not at the table. And I'd go back into the kitchen and she'd be eating sort of the bones, the cartilage, because she was the youngest child. She had to get what she could. Mm -hmm. But meanwhile, she's 79, 80 years old, strong, great posture and healthy. And I realized we are a brothless generation. Wow. Yeah. Whereas think about this, when you're hospitalized, say that you have tonsillitis or whatever it is, if you're convalescing, what do you get? Broth and gelatin. You're right. You're that's right. that's yeah. what that is. You're right. and, and they don't know why anymore, but that is known, bone broth, as the food to consume when you can digest nothing wow. else. Wow. Take a look at the screen. This is an offer, and you're going to see it a couple of times, okay? But take a look at, the, there's the offer. That is offer number one, okay? So that, that means on the screen, your best value buy would be four bottles uh, and you get two free, okay? They're, they're, it's not bottles, actually, it's containers, okay? And, uh, and you get a free book. That's offer number one. G write that toll-free number down. Please do this, please do this, please do this. You know, they say if you say it three times, people actually do it. Okay, so write that down because you know what you're going to do? After this program is over, you're going to say, did you write that number down? First thing you're going to say. Or when you get to a place and you say, you know, they were talking, you, you talk to somebody else and they, and they talk about this. And, you know, I just saw Her Herman Sharon on that show, they were talking about bone broth. Do you have a number? No. You didn't write it down. That's going to happen to you. So write the number down, even if you think you'll never use it. Just write it on something. Put it on in our, you know, I keep a journal. Put it someplace so you can refer back to it. Because mm -hmm. it's going to be important to you, I'm telling you, if you care at all about the body. And, it, and is it, I mean, like, uh, you know, I'll be 80 next birthday. And they say, well, you know, it's too late for you. <laughs> is it? 
No, you know, no, it's not. You know, I, I, I really think, and I'm saying this for my mom here, I think she feels better now in her mid-60s than she did yes. in her 30s. And so, you know, we've taken care of people of all ages. There we go, fist bump. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, you know, and, and I think that, I mean, now is just as an important time as ever. And, you know, I think college, and here's the thing, too. Once somebody hits 20, the age 25, their body produces less and less collagen as they age. So this is really important for anybody, especially getting into their 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s, 90s. I mean, I think it's really important that we're getting more collagen in our diet on a regular basis. And I'll say this too, one of the other things that we've just gotten rave reviews about with consuming bone broth, when people think of bone broth, they think of chicken soup. Yeah. Our bone broth is uniquely flavored to where people have said it's the best tasting powder do they've use, ever had. Do you use free range chicken? I mean, when yeah. they where yeah. they, they can our, roam around? Yeah, I mean, our chickens do, are do really? extremely Cage healthy, cage-free cage chickens. And and the other thing, the vanilla tastes great, the chocolate. In fact, my dad is like an old military guy, and he typically only mm -hmm. eats meat and potatoes, literally. Like, <laughs> we tried to get him to eat sushi once, <laughs> wouldn't do it. And even <laughs> he loves dad. this. In fact, he does yeah. the chocolate uh, every night for dessert now. And so, again, <laughs> it's... Can we it's, make a shake? Yeah, let's, let's do it. Let's That's go. great. Let's go. We're, 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 follow us, guys. We're going to make a shake. Make a shake, and uh, uh, tell us what we need to do, because we'll just use our little shaker here. Absolutely. So now, th this is the superfood smoothie that I have my mom make every morning. Yeah. It's what I have, I've had my patients do for years. And, you know. Jordan, it, if he this, does something incorrectly, just. I got yeah. it. OK, good. Yeah, this is a great way to really support and transform your health. And think about this. If people just start making a smoothie for breakfast. Yeah. OK, and well, watch this, guys. The other stuff, watch what he's doing. Now, what kind of so, milk is it? So this is coconut milk. And coconut milk is high in what are called MCTs, those are medium chain triglycerides, which are great for your supporting your energy, great for your overall health. So we have some really great healthy fat in here. The next thing we're gonna add in here are some blueberries. Oh. Oh. Blueberries have loads and loads and loads of antioxidants. Wow. which are going to be great here too so we're going to add some blueberries that in. adds that flavor doesn't it it does the blueberry flavor is great all right the next thing we're going to add in are a couple strawberries all right so we got these strawberries here so and he's so particular he uses a spoon yeah, for there we go i just grab them with my hands all right and then we're going to add just a few more things here as well uh this bone broth protein powder and what's really amazing about this bone broth protein it tastes amazing it's got 20 grams of collagen protein and the other thing is it also has again collagen it has glucosamine chondroitin hyaluronic acid these are the ingredients you need now to this support. is the vanilla right this is the vanilla okay. flavor yeah. and this is great for supporting healthy skin you want to transform your skin so you, just this is one, one scoop one scoop and it's it's gluten free it's paleo friendly it's keto friendly and uh, now, it tastes delicious. I had a little bit of cinnamon. Oh, that's great. Yeah, cinnamon is also high in antioxidants, great for supporting healthy blood sugar levels. So that's great. So we're going to blend it up here. All right. And think about this, too. If you just start doing this shake, just changing breakfast, you're changing 33% of your diet. So you don't have to change everything. Just changing breakfast, doing the smoothie can go a long way to your health. <laughs> Is it going to keep going? Or yeah, keep it going. Up? Keep it going. Okay. I, I like it. Well done. Yeah. All right, there we go. All right, pull it out here. Have a few glasses. Make okay. glasses for everybody here. Why well, don't you want yes. one? Yes. Come on. All right, so. All right, we're going to pour this out. And by the way, Jordan, we're going to, we're, we're going to do a taste test here with everybody, see what everybody thinks about this. And my, my, but again, my, yeah. this bone broth protein, is, it's, Get right over it's by your sort of the ultimate. Son. You know, I had somebody ask me uh, recently, they said, Dr. X, if I could only take one supplement, what would it be? And I told them it would be bone broth protein because it's, you know, today collagen is one of the biggest things that we're all missing in our diet. And, you know, I've had people... I know that people have taken supplements and powders before and said, yeah, I didn't notice much of a difference. People who take this have said, I noticed a dramatic difference in my body. Wow. And what's interesting is there are multiple sources of protein today that people use. Plant protein, whey protein, egg protein. Bone broth protein is perhaps the most digestible protein. And it's not just protein, it is so much more. You're literally getting five supplements in one. You don't have to buy glucosamine and chondroitin anymore. Oh, Hyaluronic wow. acid for your skin, collagen. So this is an all-in-one. You can mix it in a blender, a shaker cup. You can add strawberries, blueberries. And in fact, those who are watching, if they 
take advantage of offer number one. They'll get a free copy of Dr. Axe's Bone Broth Breakthrough with about 50 recipes on how to get bone broth protein into every meal. I put it in meatloaf. Mm. There's a pure yeah. variety that we put in meatloaf. Mm -hmm. You can make soups with it. Then you can make smoothies. Dr. Axe makes this great chia seed, wow. chocolate, bone broth pudding. Goodness. You can make brownies. Can we put up on the screen meal. the offer right now? Offer number one, if you put that up for me. You can keep talking. Uh, there's the offer number one. That you just said, you get uh, two free and you get a free book and take a look at that, four containers of that and two free. And then Dave, show me the offer number two, if you do, there's offer number two. Three bottles of bone broth protein, and you can do with that, in fact, we use the blue one today, we use the vanilla. So you can actually do what you just saw, and I mean, I, I would imagine people get kind of innovative, don't they? They absolutely do. Like they get, Cherry put, vanilla smoothie, you, you can make chocolate cookie dough. The Dr. Axe team is so good with recipes, you will literally get bone broth protein in every meal. And, and what Josh was mentioning earlier in terms of who is a candidate for bone broth yeah. protein, I've said that if every preschool and every wow. uh, assisted wow. living facility required bone broth every day, people would look and feel better. Mm -hmm. This is a superfood yes. for mm -hmm. all ages, but it's a superfood of the ages. <laughs> now, how long does that last you usually? Container? This is 20 servings, but mm -hmm. check this out. Each mm -hmm. serving gives you the equivalent of two and a half cups of homemade bone broth. So this is an absolute great value. It costs about six to ten dollars per serving in a store to buy this kind of quality bone broth. Mm -hmm. Each serving here is around two dollars. Okay, doctor, I haven't seen you drink here. Yeah, I've been okay. drinking it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What does everybody I'm just think the, here? I'm just I, the I already cupbearer. had a giant glass of my bone broth protein I mean, superfood smoothie I, for breakfast, I, I'm too. Not, so. I'm not kidding you, it is good. Yes, mm -hmm. it is very good. It is, it, it, what do you think, Mom? I love it. Love it. I, yeah. 20 I it grams day. of protein per serving. So if you're an athlete, yeah. if you're someone who wants to look better yeah. on the outside. I've challenged people, take two to three servings a day of bone broth protein, take a selfie, and I think in three weeks, oh. your face will look better. Yeah. What can you, you how, where can you say that about another protein? Smart. That's smart. That'd be okay. interesting. Dave, just real quick, put, put the offer back up on the screen, because we got, what do we got, Brooke, a, a minute? Brooke, hello, Brooke, we got a minute? About a minute. Okay, put those back, yeah, there you go. There's okay. two. There's, that's offer number two. Take the number down, please. Okay, one eight five 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 one nine four zero seven five. It's a toll-free number. That's offer number two. There it is. Three bottles of bone broth protein, and here's the offer number one, Dave. There you go. Okay, you get four containers, and if you buy the four containers, I mean this is win-win. You get two free. And you get a free book. Put the number down: one eight five 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 one nine four zero seven five. By the way, a portion of what you purchase—this is the win-win part—goes back to this ministry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, folks, it's helping you. It's helping the ministry. Yeah. Can you get any better than that? The answer would be no. Thank you for joining us. God bless you. Bye-bye.